Hi Pisces, Siberia from Cats and Cards. I'm going to get out messages for Pisces members only read. This is for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Sign, and North Node. Please click that like, subscribe button. Thank you, badge members. Ooh, Pisces, you have the mother card within three to six months, so you're burning karma off fast. There's something changing here when it comes to contracts. There may be something limiting going on when it comes to being able to nurture your home or passions here. So I'm seeing um, changes with money. Virgo energy, the number two, the number five. Fives are unexpected changes and two are being at the right place, right time. So there is, there is inflexibility when it comes to like control or manipulation here, car and balance. So there needs to be some type of balancing out when it comes to alternative interests. Also, there's something unexpected when it comes to a mother and a child. I feel like there's some type of excitement coming in, Pisces. Give me one more for the mother and child card. You also have 5-5 five, five in your reading. There could be some type of... Um, there could be some type of excitement for some of you. Others of you, this is transformation when it comes to life or soulmates. This could be... <laughs> I love this energy. Beautiful energy. Recognition is definitely coming in for you, Pisces. You could be 65 or older. You don't have to be. Sagittarius and Gemini energy. I feel like uh, amongst all of this, there is like um, universal support. And it's coming in in large amounts for you. Um, remember at this time, how you treat the universe is how you'll get that energy back. There's dark and light energy here with those abrupt changes. You see, um, a person trying to receive mental clarity when it comes to agreements, unions, um, watch out for, um, car overheating or car issues here. Cause I'm getting that fire or that control. Watch your speed. The number 75 is here. Also, you have a boat. You have a car. This is different activities. You have Phoenix. So there's definitely like a feminine and a child. Or um, if you're in your masculine or if you're in your feminine energy masculines, you're going through a transformation most definitely when it comes to alchemizing and finding purpose. Journey is here and it's mirroring this achievements, ego. Maybe you're mastering all these parts of life right now. The number 10, I'm also getting the number 16, Pis Pisces. I almost said princess. Maybe somebody calls their daughter princess or... Um, you watch Prince Disney princess movies, thief energy. Um, don't let something take away from all what's going on in your life, the true purpose or the true good. Um, you may be dealing with this energy next 24. You have the number 75. You have the number 555 in your reading, Pisces. Give me more for Pisces. There is a lot of change coming out with contracts. The number eight here. Maybe somebody's manipulating um, it to go in their favor and you feel like there's no justice here. But the high honors card comes out. Spirit is watching over you. There's going to be something that manifests for you at the right time. Give me the person on Pisces mind, please, Spirit. Give me the person on Pisces mind, please. For members only read the high priestess. Ooh. You could be thinking of another Pisces or water sign or an air sign. You may want to shift energy like um, betrayal energy when it comes to work or commitment. Um, maybe there's an awareness that you have that not everyone always gets along. Um, I feel here you bring people together. It's more of you have a therapeutic energy. There's Scorpio. There's Virgo energy here. There's Aquarius energy. Give me the person on Pisces mind, please. The Eight of Pentacles, they, you may work with this person, mind over matter. They may be um, going through a spiritual awakening. There's also two masculines here. This could be like, there's Aries, there's Scorpio energy. Maybe somebody is putting their mind to work in order to get over something. Because look how this tower comes and it's like, it, it's meant to stop this person, but they're not letting it stop them. 
Give me energy for masculine, please, spirit. What does masculine need to know right now? Masculine Pisces. What does masculine Pisces need to know right now? The Nine of Wands is in reverse. So it's like, don't go back through something. Um, don't be defensive right now, but still defend and have boundaries. Defensive means like being in your ego or telling people off all the time. It just means having boundaries. Nine of Cups in reverse. Hmm. You could be putting away like addictive behaviors or um, turning down offers so that you can save money. The Seven of Pentacles is here. Longevity and wealth. Give me wealth cards for Pisces masculine, please, spirit. Sailing to calmer waters. Things may calm down with work. You're going to be standing in your power. You could be part of a union. I feel like this is new energy with this page of wands. You could be prospecting and like um, communications or I see like lithium or I see iron work or I see fire. <clears throat> I feel like people need to come together at work or you'll be picking up more hours. This could be a lot of defensive people at work or childish behaviors. The ace of wands in reverse work is just telling you to just work. Don't really participate in all of it. Um, uh, excuse me. Spirit is telling you to just work. Don't participate in all of it. Kind of hold on to your money right now. Still hold that vision. Give me feminines, please, spirit. What does feminine need to know at this time? Three of wands. There could be delays because of indecision. It's like there's a lot of things going on. This is an emotional like um, theft. It's like you're going deeper within. It's taking away from the people that want to spend time with you here when you're in your head a lot, though. Pisces Feminine. Give me more for Pisces Feminine. The shadow side. You're dealing more shadow work out here. I feel this may help you come out on top to help others, but there could be a masculine here that misses you. Um, the world misses you. It could be about two children. There's Venusian energy. You could be dealing with a Libra, an Aquarius, a Scorpio. You could do online work or something here. And you're not really saying what's going on. Is it really creating growth or um, ascension? I, I'm not seeing it in the cards. But it's like something you're definitely going through. What is Pisces transmuting the next 48 spirit? Ooh, so you're putting bad karma in reverse. I love that. You have no karma at this time. There's forgiveness, contemplation, cure, Pisces. A lot of changes are still required. It doesn't mean you're done healing, but this was in reverse. Awesome. The mental imprisonment card is also in reverse. You're finding mental awakening and awareness. Success and love is also here. The opposite, the opposition card. So things you attract are definitely things you're trying to heal from, but you have a way that you bring people together. Remember, not everything is sugar. It could be salt. Just watch out. More changes on the horizon, Pisces. Yeah, yeah. Don't you love that? Let's get more into it. Members only read. Moving away from energies that don't serve you. This could be um, cleaning up like pack rat energy, getting rid of those thoughts. You're on your way to your north node. If you're not feeling like you're going down the right path, you definitely are Pisces. Um, this is part of your growth, your learning period. Let's finish up with these last cards. Cyberbully, watch what you um, take in from the internet. I'm um, destroyed heritage in reverse. I feel like you're fixing what's broken. You also may have an overactive third eye or you need to work with it more, work with your intuition more. So that is what spirit has for you. Thank you, Pisces.